New tonight, more reactions are pouring out as the former U.S. President Jimmy Carter continues to receive hospice care at home. The former president turned 98 years old last year and is the oldest living president. Isabella Rosales is in Plains, Georgia with more. Lord, we'd be amiss this morning if we did not lift President Carter to you. Sunday morning in Plains, Georgia, it was packed for Sunday school at a service at Maranatha Baptist Church. This is where former President Jimmy Carter taught his traditional Sunday school in his hometown for years until his health forced him to give it up in 2020. On Saturday, the news came that the 98-year-old former president has decided to spend his remaining time at home with his family and to receive hospice care instead of additional medical intervention, according to the Carter Center. In 2015, former President Carter announced he had survived brain and liver cancer. In 2019, he had surgery for a broken hip and received 14 stitches after hitting his head. Then he was treated for a minor pelvic fracture before undergoing surgery to relieve pressure on his brain. I love you! In 2022, the Carters were seen out enjoying the 25th annual Peanut Festival Parade in Plains. They were seen riding in a red 1946 Ford convertible while waving at the crowd. Meanwhile, wishes for comfort and peace are pouring in on social media for the former president. Carter's grandson and former Georgia State Senator Jason Carter posted this tweet, saying in part he visited his grandparents and they are at peace. When I was sick, he sat with me for an hour. Whether you believe in his political persuasions or whatever you think, you know for a fact being here that they're genuine people that care. In Plains, Georgia, I'm Isabel Rosales reporting.